Green roofs are great for stormwater quality that uh, they can contain up to 50 to 90 percent of the rain the rainfall and uh, they also they filter out a lot of the plants in the soil actually filters out heavy metals organics pollutants from the air and from the rain and it's very important because a lot of the, the rainfall in this area enters our storm drains and goes directly to the Sacramento River and the Sacramento River is a drinking water for two-thirds of California Library visitors have a variety of positive reactions to the green roof. They love it, they're intrigued by it, they've never heard of a green roof, they think it's beautiful, they look at it for the aesthetic qualities, and then when you tell them how it helps the library um, be more sustainable, then they really like it. Well, the green roof is in the building because uh, mostly because of the public process that we used to build the building. Um, it's something that the public really wanted. But it also turns out to be beneficial in that um, it provides additional insulation over the children's library. It increases the lifespan of the roof. The uh, roofing material is a standard uh, PVC material, which has typically a 20-year lifespan, uh, but it's photodegradable. So if you uh, put dirt over it and keep the sun off of it, you can double its life expectancy. Our main philosophy is to serve the community. And the main ways that we do that are through information, whether it's technology or print media or audio media or services, databases, classes, programs. That's the main way we serve the community. The green roof is a way, combined with the other ecological features of the library, that we can be a model of environmental sustainability and responsibility, and we can also offer um, less impact on the grid, on the electrical grid. We build a big new building, but we build it in a way that it's not going to impact the grid negatively. There are many ways the residents of Reading can incorporate low impact development on their own properties. As well as having green roofs, they can also have rain gardens, rain barrels, bioswales. These are all ways of capturing the rainwater before it enters our driveways and streets, storm drains, and eventually going to the Sacramento River.